ओं गणा गणपति हवामहे कवि कवीनामुपमश्रवस्तम ज्येष्ठराज ब्रह्मण ब्रह्मणस्पतान शृण्वन्नोति सीदसादनम श्री महागणाधिपत नम गुरुर्ब्रह्म गुरुर्विष्णु गुरुर्देव महेशर गुरुसाक्षात्म ब्रह्म तस्म श्रीगुरव नम सदाशिव सरंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यम अस्मदाचार्यपर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा ओ डर फ्रेंड्स इन द लास्ट क्लास वी कंप्लीटेड द फोर्टी एथ श्लोक ऑफ द लेवेन्थ अध्याय ऑफ गीता फोर्टी एथ श्लोक ईज न वेदयज्ञाध्ययन न दान न च क्रियाभिर्न तपोभिग्र बै आल दीस् एक्टिविटी यू कैनाट सी दिस् फॉम एंड नो वन एल्स अपार्ट फ्रम यू नो वन एल्स हेज सीन दिस् फॉम अर्लियर ऐ हेव जस्ट शोन इट टू यू बिकॉज ऑफ मै ग्रेस बिकॉज ऑफ मै कैंडनेस टू यू बिकॉज अर्जुन हेज टू बी मोटिवेटेड अर्जुन हेज टू बी गिवन ए लारजर पिक्चर अबउट वाट इज हिस् धर्म सो सो हियर हि सेज न वेदाध्ययन ही न यज्ञाध्ययन ही नईदर बै स्टडी ऑफ वेद नार बै स्टडी ऑफ यज्ञ नार बै चारीटबल ऐक्टिविटी एंड नाट बै वेरियस अदर टाइप्स ऑफ ऐक्टिविटी ऑल दीज तपोभि उग्रैहि उग्रैहि तपोभि ऑल सिवियर पेनेस एंड वाट नाट दिस् फॉम के नाट बी सीन सो दट इज वाट से वी सा इन द लास्ट क्लास एंड वी रेड दि भाष्यम आलो द कंप्ली वी कंप्लीटेड द लास्ट लाइन ऑफ द भाष्यम हे कुरु प्रवीर अप टू दट पॉइंट वी कंप्लीटेड वी हेव टू रीड दि नेक्स्ट श्लोक दट ईज फोर्टी नाइन्थ वर्स वी हेव टू रीड लेट अस रीड माते व्यथा माच विमूढ़ भावो माते व्यथा माच विमूढ़ भावो दृष्ट्वा रूपम घोरमी द्रुम ममेदम दृष्ट्वा रूपम घोरमी द्रुम ममेदम व्यपेत भी प्रीतम मना पुनस्त्वम यस व्यपेत भी प्रीतम मना पुनस्त्वम तदेव मेरूपमिदम प्रपश्या तदेव मेरूपमिदम प्रपश्या सो ही सेस हे अर्जुन तदेव रूपम इदम मम प्रपश्या that old form of mine you please see now so he says ma te vyatha te vyatha ma bhut let let you not have any may, may you not have any uh, say fear vyatha or distress vyatha is distress basically a mind which is shaken up so that condition that uh, frame of mind is called vyatha so ma te vyatha ma is negative it is to indicate the negative let let there not be may you not suffer mate vyatha means let there not be any vyatha for you may you not undergo any vyatha may you not have any distress so that is the meaning of ma ma means let the there is a is a negating something mate vyatha then ma cha vimudha bhavah and also vimudha bhavah mudha we know mood that is mudha mudha is delusion mudha moha it comes from the word moha one who is having moha is called mudha vimudha bhavah v is only an upasarga adding to the intensity of that moha <laughs> adding to the intensity of the delusion may you not have any such may may you not have any such delusion so that is the meaning of ma te vimudha bhavah means may you not have any delusion then why rupam ghoram idrusham drushtva idrusham mama gho rupam drushtva having seen such fierce rupam ghoram rupam ghoram rupam that is what we saw in all these earlier classes we saw this ghora rupam what is that ghora rupam that is the who are you he asked he said kalosmi lokakshaya krut pravurdha i am that time i am that all devouring time i am that all uh, say devouring means that is chewing up i am just chewing up everything <laughs> so in in fact you know in yaksha prashna there is one um, so there is one beautiful shloka because in mahabharata uh, what is the vision of sage vyasa about kalam kalam is time time is something which is all devouring that is uh, the, in i mean throughout mahabharata you find the same image you find the same concept of time in mahabharata so for example in that yaksha prashna you know the context of yaksha prashna Yaksha Prashna, where all these Pandavas uh, exclu- uh, uh, just accept uh, Bharna, accept this. I mean, uh, the uh, Dharma Raja. All other people, they die. They drink water in a particular, uh, say, lake, and then they dry. They die. And then Dharma Raja goes in search of them, and then there, there he sees that Yaksha. Yaksha is the man who has killed all of them because they violated his order. 
and then he says okay if you want your brothers to live you have to answer my questions so that is the sequence that we know that story uh, if you have not seen that yaksha prashna episode you may uh, verify just look up mahabharatam and then see that yaksha prashna there are some wonderful questions so there yaksha asks one question what are the uh, what is the greatest vartha on earth what is the greatest news <laughs> what is the great vartha of course has two meanings in sanskrit one is one is vartha that is what is happening that is one thing vartha also means commerce and trade etc but here of course yaksha is asking in terms of what is the news what is the greatest happening on earth so he says bhutani kala pachatiiti vartha the only vartha is the only vartha in the human uh, say society is that always the kalam the this all devouring time is eating up it is chewing up here of course bhutani kala pachati it is cooking and then he, he gives that image of cooking so there uh, asmin maha mohamaye katahe this whole universe is something like a huge vessel which is uh, nothing but our maha, maha moha asmin maha mohamaye katahe our own delusion our own delusion means that inability to see brahman and in only the i mean the attitude to see only the world and then this world of duality so this is what is moha according to vedanta so this mohamaye katahe in this great vessel called um, say the universe then all this sun etc he he is the agni he is the agni diva ratri that is night and day they, that is the indhanam that is the fuel and then masa rutu darvi parighattanena Ma, masa masa means month then rutu is a season this months and seasons they are the ladles by which this cook great cook he cooks all the people so parighattanam parighattanam means you rotate all those uh, say move upside down move all these people upside down and then make fry them properly so you are all fried we are all cooked in that maha mohamaye katahe bhutani kalah pachati iti vartha so the only news is that everywhere you see wherever you see you go to say world news world news you see some somewhere some some forces occupying some country and killing some hundreds of thousands of people in some other country there is some sort of civil war some other country there is some other type of uh, say killing going on so all these types of killings and then death is the only vartha all through the whole, all through the human history so that is what he says kala rutu parighatta darvi parighatta nena bhutani kalah pachati so it cooks so in english there is saying cooking the goose so kala is something it is a great cook it is it cooks the goose of everybody <laughs> cooking the goose means destroying destroying somebody's uh, say chances of success etc so so that is cooking the goose kala is something which is cooking the goose so that sort of fears the farm arjuna has seen so ghoram roopam idrusham drushtva having seen my fears roopam in this particular farm that all that time which is which is eating up or chewing up everybody so that sort of thing have seen and then vyapeta bhihi pritamanaha punah tvam bhava so you please you become vyapeta bhihi punah punah means again tvam you vyapeta bhihi pritamanaha bhava that is vyapeta bhihi vyapeta bhihi means uh where, where the fear has gone away vyapeta that is some fear has um, say left that is what is called vyapeta vyapeta bhihi you be one free from fear vyapeta bhihi free from fear and preeta mana whose mind is preeta preeta means happy preeta mana one you have, your happiness is restored to you all your fear has gone and then your happiness is restored to you so that is what is called preeta manaha preeta manaha punastvam tadeva me roopam idam prapashya tadeva that old form of mind with that four, four hands etc uh, say that roopam idam prapashya so in the last class i was just reading out uh, the note from nilakantha dikshita nilakantha chaturdhara where he says the initial form was that multitude of arms and what not the innumerable arms innumerable uh, heads and then innumerable mouths so, all that so what arjuna wanted to see was that form uh, with four hands and then shankha chakra gada etc etc that is what is the, that is also not the normal form of krishna the normal form of krishna is a human form 
but he wanted to see that particular farm which uh, uh, which was his original farm when he was born so that farm he is now showing punaha tvam tadeva me rupam idam prapashya you please see that farm for which you have asked so that is what it is so let us see the bhashyam mate vyatha mate vyatha ma bhut te bhayam ma bhut te bhayam ma cha vimudha bhavah ma cha vimudha bhavah vimudha chittata vimudha chittata drushtva upalabhya drushtva upalabhya rupam ghoram rupam ghoram idruk yatha darshitam mama idam idruk yatha darshitam mama idam vyapeta bhihi vigata bhayah vyapeta bhihi vigata bhayah prita manascha san ಪುನಃಪುಯ that is ma bhut te bhayam ma bhut that is one say one way of saying ma bhut may let there not be let there not be any fear for you let there not be may, may you not have any fear so that is what the is the meaning of ma bhut ma bhut te te means to you bhayam may you not have any fear then ma cha vimudha bhavah vimudha bhavah means vimudha chittata that, that let your mind chittam here means generally mind let may your mind not have any such delusion then drushtva upalabhya upalabhya means having seen rupam ghoram this sort of fears rupam idruk yatha darshitam idruk rupam idruk means this type of drushtva rupam ghoram idrung mamedam idruk plus mama idam so that is what is the break up idruk means this type of this type of fears idruk is this type of fears rupam yatha darshitam what i have shown just to you idam ವ್ಯಪೇತ ಭೀಹಿ ವಿಗತ ಭಯ ವಿಗತ ಭಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹೂಸ್ ಫಿಯರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾನ್ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ 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 ಸೀನ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ಸಫರ್ಡ್ ಬಟ್ ನೌ ವ್ಯಪೇತ ಭೀಹಿ ಭೂತ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಯು ನೌ ಬಿಕಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ವ್ಯಪೇತ ಭೀಹಿ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಯು ನೌ ಬಿಕಮ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ವಿದೌಟ್ ಫಿಯರ್ ನೌ ಲೆಟ್ ಯುವರ್ ಫಿಯರ್ ಗೋ ಅವೇ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಯು ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಪ್ರೀತಮನಾಶ್ಚ ಸನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೆನ್ ಪ್ರೀತಮನಾ ಇನ್ ಅ ವೆರಿ ಹ್ಯಾಪಿ ಮೈಂಡ್ ಯು ಸಿ ಯು ನೌ ಸಿ ದಿಸ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ you have earlier undergone all this tension and what not now may your fear go away and then with with a happy mind you please see my present rupam so pritamanashyasan punaha means bhuyaha that is again tvam tadeva chaturbhujam rupam that four handed form that four handed form shankha chakra gadadharam shankha in one hand chakra gada etc etc tava ishtam rupam so that is what you desired ishtam rupam idam prapashya you please see that form so it yarjunam iti it yarjunam iti so sanjaya uvacha sanjaya uvacha it yarjunam vasudevastathoktva it yarjunam vasudevastathoktva svakam rupam darshayama sabhuya svakam rupam darshayama sabhuya ashwasayama sacha bhitamenam ಸಂಜಯ ಟೋಲ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸಂಜಯ ಇಸ್ ಟೆಲಿಂಗ್ ಧೃತರಾಷ್ಟ್ರ ಧೃತರಾಷ್ಟ್ರ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಲಿಸನರ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಹೋಲ್ ಮಹಾಭಾರತ ಧೃತರಾಷ್ಟ್ರ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಲಿಸನರ್ ಸೊ ಇತಿ ಅರ್ಜುನ ವಾಸುದೇವ ತಥಾ ಉಕ್ತ ತಥಾ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾನರ್ ಅರ್ಜುನ ಟು ಅರ್ಜುನ ವಾಸುದೇವ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಉಕ್ತ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಟೋಲ್ ಅರ್ಜುನ ಹ್ಯಾವಿಂಗ್ ಟೋಲ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಫ್ಯಾಷನ್ ದೆನ್ ವಟ್ ಡಿಡ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಡು ಸ್ವಕಂ ರೂಪಂ ದರ್ಶ ದರ್ಶಯಾಸ ಭೂಯ ಭೂಯ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಸ್ವಕಂ ರೂಪಂ ದರ್ಶಯಾಸ ಹಿ ಇಸ್ ಓನ್ ರೂಪ ಹಿ ಇಸ್ ಓನ್ ರೂಪ ಹಿ ಶೋಡ್ ಹಿ ಡಿಸ್ಪ್ಲೇಡ್ ದರ್ಶಯಾಸ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹಿ ಶೋಡ್ ಹಿ ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟೆಡ್ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ದ ಅರ್ಜುನ ದಿಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅರ್ಜುನ ದೆನ್ ಆಶ್ವಾಸಯಾಸ ಚ ಭೀತಂ ಏನಂ ಸೊ ಭೀತಂ ಏನಂ ದಿಸ್ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹೂ ಈಸ್ ರಿಯಲಿ ಟೆರಿಫೈಡ್ ಏನಂ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಮ್ಯಾನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಪರ್ಟಿಕ್ಯುಲರ್ ಮ್ಯಾನ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ರೆಫರಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಅರ್ಜುನ ಭೀತಂ ಏನಂ ಆಶ್ವಾಸಯಾಸ ಭೀತಂ ಏನಂ ಅರ್ಜುನ ಆಶ್ವಾಸಯಾಸ ಸೊ ಹಿ ಕನ್ಸೋಲ್ ಅರ್ಜುನ ಹೂ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಬೀನ್ ಸೇ ಹೂ ಹೂ ವಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಹೂ ವಾಸ್ ಪ್ಯಾನಿಕ್ ಸ
who was actually terrified. So that sort of Arjuna, he, this Krishna consoled. Having uh, got back to his original shape, he consoled. Then uh, Bhitam Enam, Bhutva Punaha, Again, what happened? Saumya Vapuhu, Saumya Vapuhu Mahatma. Even that forehand Chaturbhuja Rupam also he withdrew and then came back to normal Manusha Rupam. Bhutva Punaha, Saumya Vapuhu. Saumya means pleasant. Saumya is very happy, pleasant, very, um, say, uh, not, um, say, inducing any, any type of fear or anything like that. Gentle form. Saumya actually means pleasant, gentle. So, that is the meaning of Saumya. Saumya Vapuhu. Vapu means body. Saumya Vapuhu. That is a very normal, normal frame. He came back to his normal frame. Saumya Vapuhu Mahatma. Mahatma refers, referring to Krishna. So, Arjuna, what, Krishna, what did Krishna do? Evam Arjunam Uktva. Having told Arjuna like this, Svakam Rupam Dashayamasa, he again showed that original, that four-handed form. Then later, Ashwasayamasa Cha Bhitam Enam. He, Enam Arjunam, this particular Arjuna, he consoled Ashwasa Yamasa, Lord Krishna consoled this Arjuna, who was Bhitaha, Bhitaha means panic stricken, afraid. Then, Bhutva Punaha Saumya Vapuhu Mahatma, Punaha Saumya Vapuhu Bhutma, Bhutva Ashwasa Yamasa, he again came back to that normal form with two hands and then he consoled Arjuna, so that is the meaning. So let us see this thing. Ityevam Arjunam Prati Vasudevaha Tathabhutam Vachanam Uktva Svakam Vasudeva Gruhe Jatam Rupam Darshayamasa Darshitavan Okay. Ityevam Arjunam Prati Arjunam Prati means to Arjuna. To Arjuna. Vasudevaha Tatha Bhutam Vachana Muktva, having told like that, he told, he, he told about, what did he say? He said, all the, this particular Rupa cannot be seen, even by Veda Dhyayana, even by Yajna Dhyayana, all types of charities, etc. By all this karma, etc. it cannot be seen, because of my grace you have seen this. So, all these things having told like that, then uh, Vachana Muktva, Svakam Rupam. What is that Svakam Rupam? Svakam is one Rupa. What is that one Rupa? Vasudeva Gruhe Jatam Rupam. So the form with which he was born in the house of Vasudeva. When, in the, when he was born in the house of Vasudeva, he wanted to tell them, he wanted to display, wanted to tell everybody that he was not a normal child, he was the avatara. So that is why he was born with four hands. And later on the request of the parents, he became a normal form. He became, he came back to normal human form. So that is what we see in uh, say Bhagavatam etc. So, Vasudeva Gruhe Jatam Rupam, Darshayamasa means he showed, Darshitavan. Then, Bhūyaha Punaha, Ashwasayamasa Cha, Ashwasitavan Cha, Bhītam Enam, Bhūtva Punaha, Saumya Vapuhu Prasanna Dehaha, Mahatma. So, Mahatma is Krishna, that Mahatma Krishna, Saumya Vapuhu, Saumya Vapuhu means that pleasant body, Prasanna Dehaha, Saumya Vapuhu, Shankaracharya is saying Prasanna Dehaha, Bhutva, having become like that, then Punaha, Ashwasa Yamasacha, he consoled, he gave courage, he patted him on the back and then said, okay, my boy, don't be scared, don't be scared, you please, you see my present form now. Ashwasita Vanscha, Bhitam Yenam, Bhutva Punaha Saumya Vapuhu Prasanna Deha. Here itself, they again, Shanganelakanta is again writing, Yad Arjunena Prarthitam Chaturbhuja Rupam Dharana Vishayam Rupam. So he say, he showed that particular Chaturbhuja Rupam for the purpose of Dharana, for the purpose of proper realization. Because this sort of, um, when you meditate on Krishna, you are meditating on this Chaturbhuja Rupam, isn't it? Normally when we meditate on Krishna, we meditate on that Chaturbhuja Rupam, that is for purpose of meditation. But normally, his Saumya Vapu is normally in a human form only. So then, Chaturbhuja Rupam, then, Tadapi Tirodadhe Ityartha, Tadapi Tirodadhe means he withdrew even that form. He withdrew even that form and then became normal. Became normal means he appeared in a human form.
with two hands. So, Dashayamasa Saumya Vapuhu. Then, Drushtvedam Iti. So, Arjuna. Now, it is the response of Arjuna. The, the now, of course, the meter also is changing. All through the Adhyaya, we saw the meter was totally different because he was describing a fierce Rupam. So, the meter also changed in accordance with what was being described by uh, Sage Vyasa. So, here, of course, uh, Arjuna is coming back to his normal, uh, uh, say, um, uh, style of speaking. Drushtvedam manusham rupam Tava saumyam janardana Idani masmi samvruttaha Sacheta prakrutim gataha So having seen your manusham rupam Idam manusham rupam drushtva Having seen your human form Manusham rupam is human form Manushya deha Manushya Deha, that is the human form. Having seen your human form, Tava Saumyam, Saumya Vapu, he said, that gentle, normal, pleasant form, Saumyam, He Janardana, O Janardana, Idani Asmi Samvruttaha, Aham Samvruttaha Asmi. That is, I have now become uh, very uh, composed, I have now become quiet, uh, my fear has gone away, so that is it. Idani Asmi Samvruttaha, Sachetaha, uh, Sacheta Samvruttaha, that also you can say, Sacheta Samvruttaha means my wits, my wits have come back to me. Chetas is, you know, Chetas is mind. Earlier his mind was not in his control. His mind had, had panicked and gone. So I have now come back. My wits are now back, back, back with me. Sacheta Prakrutim Gataha. Prakrutim is my own nature. I, my own nature is restored to me. Prakrutim Gataha. So earlier this man was so so disturbed and so uh, I mean so totally out of mind that uh, he is now saying now I have come back to my mind my wits have come back to me my 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 mind has come back to me my nature has come back to me so that is what he says idani must be samvurtaha sachetaha my mind has come back to me prakrutim gataha I have regain, regained my old form, I have regained my composure, I have regained my nature. So, that is what it is. Prakruti. Prakruti literally means my own nature. So, let us see the Bhashyam. Drushtvedam manusham rupam Drushtvedam manusham rupam Mat sakham prasannam Mat sakham prasannam Tava saumyam janardana Tava saumyam janardana Idanim adhuna Idanim adhuna Asmi samvruttaha sanjataha Asmi samvruttaha Samvrutta Sanjataha. Okay. Drushtva idam manusham rupam. Drushtva idam. Having seen this human form. Mat sakham. My dear friend. Sakha is a dear friend. Mat sakham. My close friend. Then prasannam tava saumyam. He janardana. Prasannam. Such a merciful, pleasant. Prasanna is basically kind, merciful. Prasannam tava saumyam janardana. Idanim means adhuna. Now. Aham samvrutta sanjataha. I have now come back to my original form and I am now Samrutta Sanjata actually means uh, I am now composed, I am now happy, I am now uh, say composed. Then Kim in what manner? Sachetaha. Sachetaha means his chetas, his senses have come back to him. Earlier his senses were not, uh, were not in his control. So Sachetaha, my senses have come back. Prasanna Chittaha. Sachetaha means Prasanna Chittaha. My mind also has become Prasanna, cool, pleasant. Then uh, Prakrutim Svabhavam Gatascha Asmi. Prakruti means Svabhava. My own nature. Svabhava is nature. One's own nature. That is what is called Svabhava. Svabhavam Gatosmi. I have recaptured, I have re regained my composure. I have regained my original nature. Then Sudurdarsha Miti. So, Sri Bhagavan again, uh, Lord Krishna is again saying uh, what we saw in the earlier shloka, Naveda Ignya Dhyanaihi. He is almost repeating it. Sudurdarsyamidam Sri Bhagavan Uvacha. Sudurdarsyamidam Rupam. Drushtavana Siyan Mama. Deva Apyasya Rupasya. Dityam Darshana Kangshinaha. So he says, Sudurdarsyamidam Rupam. Idam Rupam. This particular form, Sudurdarsyam. Su is one upasarga, dus is another upasarga, darsham, su durdarsham. 
ദർശ ദുർദർശം മീൻസ് ദുഃഖേന ദർശയിതും യോഗ്യം വിത്ത് ഗ്രേറ്റ് ഡിഫിക്കൽട്ടി യു ക്യാൻ സീ ദിസ് സു ദുർദർശം സു ഈസ് ആക്ച്വലി ആഡിങ് ടു ദിസ് നെഗറ്റീവ് മീനിങ് ഓൺലി സു ഈസ് ആഡിങ് ടു ദ നെഗറ്റീവ് മീനിങ് ഹിയർ ദുർദർദർശം സു ദുർദർശം മീൻസ് വിത്ത് ഗ്രേറ്റ് ഡിഫിക്കൽട്ടി ഓൺലി യു ക്യാൻ സീ ദിസ് പർട്ടിക്കുലർ ഫോം ദുർദർശം ഹൗ പോയിന്റ് ഈസ് this particular form this kala this understanding of kala understanding of this universal form is possible only by shravana manana and all these things shravana manana only all these this vedanta only when you do vedanta vichara then you know what is this brahma what is this say hiranyagarbha brahma and then what is the role of this hiranyagarbha brahma in this particular hiranyagarbha form you have got a cosmic function called laya so all these things you will know only by shravana manana etc etc so but here uh, we do not we don't know whether we can presume that he has done all that shravana etc he has done of course some veda adhyayana in his childhood that is a different thing because as part of his study as part of his syllabus uh, kshatriya it is part of the syllabus part of his syllabus to study veda <laughs> but then we can't assume that he has done from some shravana manana etc etc so this particular form cannot be understood cannot be visualized by, by normally by some 